So, looking for your own place? Here are the top reasons why everyone is choosing Block. There are now over five Block properties all over Cebu, all of which are perfectly situated in the heart and center of this bustling city. All of our properties are close to business areas, shopping malls, and medical facilities. These make it more convenient for the working class Filipino to enjoy a better quality of life. Not only that, but Block's location is easily accessible by all modes of public and private transportation, making daily commutes that much easier. With all the perks that Block has to offer, you'd think it would be expensive, but it is currently the most reasonably priced property in the market. In fact, the numbers will speak for itself. Monthly payments for a block unit only costs as much as the average monthly rent expense. Why rent when you can own? How can it be any more perfect than that, you ask? At Block, we strive to make sure you're confident and comfortable with your financial decision by simplifying payment options. There are only four simple things to consider. Our team will gladly discuss these options with you. There is no better use of your income than Block. For the amount that we spend on rent, entertainment, food, coffee, you can invest in a property that will benefit and last you a lifetime. Here are some of the reasons to love Block. Still not convinced? Here are some people who believe in Block. I'm Brian Henry Amlatko. I am a graphic designer and I'm a, also a hobbyist artist on the side. I just want I just like making people laugh or smile with, with the work that I have. On occasion, if they if it makes them feel something, then great. That's awesome. So this poor guy, his heart kept kept getting broken every single week. So I keep myself busy with things to do, but every time I pause, I still think of you. These are all the figures by Marvel. These are the best figures on the market that you can buy. I mean, they're all, you can pose them, you can, you can do a lot, a lot of stuff with them. You need a hobby outside your work. People tend to forget that. They just keep working and working and working. And for them, decongesting is just going to the beach. I'm like, no, you need, you need a creative outlet for that. So I would always recommend to anyone, if you're, if it doesn't matter how bad you draw or how good you draw, just just draw. I mean, it it can really help. The ultimate freedom is to walk away. So that that's in the same way as having your own place. You're walking away from your comfort zone. You tend to be complacent with your artwork, and I've seen that happen a lot of times with people I I, I used to work with. Although it's 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 an, it's an expensive venture to get your own place, but for me, you can't really put a price on sanity. That's why people go on vacations. But in this case, it's like a permanent vacation. My name is Nicole. I'm and currently struggling with my hedgehog. I have a company called Loud Bastard. We make wooden or bamboo amplifiers. Well, my place is, it's a mix of me and the people I've met. So we have, take for example, my Japanese kimono here. I bought this when I was in Japan with my cousin last September and we went to Asakusa. Perfect fit, don't you think? <laughs> um, it's actually pretty warm, but as you can see, the print's very good. So when I just moved in, my dad he came over one day with a bunch of picture frames and I said, what's this? And it was photographs that he had of me and him as a, when I was a child. So it's memories to look back on. It's, it's a good time. Like I said, it's a treasure box of memories. That's what your home is. Hi, I'm Heidi. I'm a writer, a lifestyle writer, and a, a research advisor support, and I do yoga and a self-confessed coffee-holic. 
They say water is an essential. I think water is also essential so that I can make coffee. The fact that you can actually bring a story in the past to the present and make you feel exactly how they felt at that time, just pure magic, and that's through words. Because when you get to a pose, you want to strive to, to get to the pose. So you have to focus and you have to concentrate and you have to listen to your body. And it's the same as writing. If you want to write sincerely so that your readers will feel you, then you have to, to focus on yourself. So it's like, like that in yoga. It's kind of like an outlet for me. I'm Carla, I'm a copywriter and um, a teacher at the University of San Carlos. The one wall near my bed is uh, reserved for all the art prints and paintings and photographs that I've collected through the years, um, through all my travels. So it's gonna be a wall full of just postcards from all over Asia, the Philippines, Europe, artworks of my friends, of my former students. <laughs> So I went up sa kong room, and then pag open ako sa door, okay, nasa bed, may box. So I was oh my god, on sa man eh! Sa kong open, rip open ang box, na wrapping, pag open, kay kanigid. This guitar sa kong bed, surprise sa kong dad, sa kong work, oh my god! <laughs> Thank you, so happy to do ito. And then dito na ako naka-realize na yun yung gi-accept, ha, di ba? To be a rock star. Although short-lived, ito siyang a dream. A teenage dream. <laughs> I fall in love with it more and more. It stands for everything that I was fighting for. I think like you're stating like your uniqueness. That's what I want. That's what I strive for. So I love the concept, everything like the painted doors, having being able to pick your color. Putting love into your home to make it you. That to me is awesome.